And, uh, and then what is your what is your favorite thing to do a pod uh to a podcast with someone like your good friend? What's my favorite? Honestly, my my favorite thing about doing um podcasts is to be able to spread a message of inclusion. Um, I think oftentimes the intellectually disabled community is overlooked. So being able to show that anyone with an intellectual disability, first of all, we're all at different levels, meaning that we all have different strengths and things that we're good at. So when you, I I love this quote, when you meet one person with autism, you've met one person with autism. Yes. Um, it, it's it's not it's not all the same, and I, I believe that for many of the uh, disabilities that we that we have, same thing with Down syndrome. I recently read a story, and you'll have to forgive me. I don't remember which state he was in, but he was a former Special Olympics athlete with Down syndrome, and he ended up um, he he ended up speaking on behalf of gosh i can't think of the the united nations he ended up speaking on behalf of the united nations and talking about down syndrome and i thought it was just um, i thought it was amazing that you can take a special olympics athlete train them and he could end up speaking at you know, on, on such a global level, I, I think that many people with a disability are capable of several different things if just given the chance. Wow, that is amazing what you do. You'd like to, yeah. you'd like to help with the individuals with intellectual disabilities and you'd like to do everything and, and, now, and now you are a great friend and a great global ambassador from the Special Olympics and I'd like to thank you to be on my show. Absolutely. Thank you so much, my friend. Sure.